I'm leaving. YouTube is not my career. It's a hobby of mine that I love to do. I've been filming for three and a half years, two years vlogging, one and a half reacting, and doing all types of other videos. Now what I do for a living, I am a sterile processing technician also known as SPD. I am certified with 10 years of experience, worked in three hospitals. What my job consists of is decontaminating. Assembling. Sterilizing. And picking cases for the operating room. You can't have surgery without our department. That is what I do. Now I've been doing a lot of soul searching for the past four years. I have depression and anxiety and there's just something missing in my life. And I will get deep into that in another video. But I'm ready to do something different, ready to stop doing the same old routine. I will keep doing what I'm doing in my career, but I will also be making double the money and traveling the country. I am leaving a permanent job at a hospital and moving forward with a travel agency. What that means is I'm gonna be going from state to state to state to state every few months working in different hospitals. And y'all gonna come with me because I will be vlogging my experience. Oh, but hold on though, I am uncensored, so I will still be reacting to videos. Guys, people already call me a minimalist. I don't need much, never have since I was little, still don't as an adult. Now what is minimalism? Minimalism is all about living with less. This includes less financial burdens such as debt and unnecessary expenses. For many minimalists, the philosophy is about getting rid of excess stuff and living life based on experiences rather than worldly possessions. Guys, I already live my life like that. Everything I own is in this house. Yes, I have a house. I have furniture. I barely use my furniture. I'm barely in my living room. I literally go to work, come home, film, and knock the fuck out. <laughs> and as you can see in my closet, I don't have much as it is. But I want to minimalize a lot more because I will be living my life on the road. So fuck it. Let's go ahead and cut my clothing in half. I did it. It was actually pretty easy. Everything else is in that bag right there. All that is gonna be donated. Now there's a difference between being broke and deciding to live with less. I've been broke. I've slept in my car. I moved from house to house, couch to rooms. I've done all that. I now own a house. I will still own my house, but I will be renting it out to family. I just wanna live my life to where nothing is planned out anymore. I want the unexpected to happen. I'm tired of living for the future and I wanna start living in the present. Now, I'm planning on doing this for a few years, y'all. I'm hoping for five, but only time will tell. So now that I cut my clothes in half, that's what I will be bringing along with 20 socks, 15 sports bras, 16 boxer briefs, 20 tanks, a few swimwear, and some sleepwear. And of course, I'm gonna bring some toiletries. You know, I gotta have my shampoo and conditioner. I gotta have my little lotion and everything. A little bit of cologne. <laughs> you know, the basics. That's gonna be my life, y'all. I'm having all kinds of feelings. I already left my job. I have the next couple of weeks to myself to pack everything up and head off to the road. I already know where I'm going. For my first assignment, I will spend 13 weeks, which is three months, in this state at this hospital. I'm not going to reveal the state yet, but look out for my next vlog because I will reveal the state. <laughs> Yo, I'm feeling all kinds of emotions. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I'm excited, I'm hyped, I'm ready for my journey, but I will admit I'm also a little nervous. I'm a little scared. I have nothing for me here. I have siblings that I love and would die for, and I know they love and would die for me but I'm just not close to any of them. I have no friends. I used to be married with stepchildren, but that's a life that no longer lives. So I have nothing here for me, y'all. But the people that I will miss dearly are my parents, my mama, and my daddy. But I will come and visit every now and then. But I gotta push myself out of this comfort zone. I need to live life on the edge. I am too young, I have no kids. What am I doing? I'm living my life like an old ass person. I can't do it no more. <laughs> so once I do what scares me, it's gonna push me to be the greatest person that I can be. And I wanna experience life to the fullest. Now, anybody can minimalize. You don't need much. You saw my closet. It wasn't much to begin with. And now that I cut it in half, I wanna show you that even with that amount of clothes, I can still put together different outfits. Y'all don't believe me. <laughs> well, goddamn it, I'm gonna have to show you. Let's go.
my god <laughs> i'm tired y'all so guys this is what i'm going to be having this is it this is going to be my life in the next few years this is all i'm going to take with me and the outfits that i showed you that i put together was only half of these clothing i didn't even show you the other half and i can still mix match everything you don't need much this is it those are my hats I'm also gonna take with me. I only wore a few of the shoes in the video. I know it's dark in my house, I apologize. I don't got much lighting. You just have to play with your clothes. You don't need much. Well, listen y'all, I, I got tired. Okay, I got tired of changing. I'm gonna go and relax and I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for my next vlog because I will be letting you know what state I'm heading to. All right, you guys, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe, and please hit that bell so you can get notified every time I upload. See you in the next video. Peace.